so here we have another question uh, related to four variable POS K map uh, the don't care condition so we have the max term values the boolean expression given in terms of the max term values and the don't care values so the max term values are 1, 2, 3, 8, 9, 10, 11, 14 and the don't care values are 7 and 15. So we'll map them. So 1, 2, 3, 8, 9, 10, 11, 14. 2, 3, 8, 9, 10, 11, 14. And the don't care values are 7 and 15. Now we have to form the groups. So here we can form a quad using these three cells at the bottom, four cells actually, 8, 9, 11, 10. Then we can form a quad involving these four cells, 10, 11, 14, 15. And uh, then we can form another quad involving cells, 9, 11, and 1 and 3 and again another quad involving cells 10 11 2 and 3 10 11 2 and 3 okay so pay attention how the groups were formed this quad involving cells 8 9 11 12 then this quad involving cells 10 11 14 15 then another quad involving cells 1, 3, 9, 11. Then the fourth quad, I think, one, uh, fifth quad involving cells 2, 3, 10, 11. Okay. So, no, no, there are four quads. Okay, four quads. Yes, 1, 2, 3, 4. Yes, four quads. So now we'll identify the common variables. For this quad, Involving the four cells at the bottom, the only common variables are a bar or b. a bar or b. For this quad involving cells 10, 11, 14, 15, the common variables in the horizontal side is a bar, and the vertical side it is c bar. Then for this quad involving cells 9, 11, 1, 3, the horizontal side B in the vertical side it is uh, D bar, B or D bar. And then for this quad involving cells 10, 11, 2 and 3 in the horizontal side again it is B and in the vertical side it is C bar. So this is the simplified Boolean expression. Okay, this is the simplified Boolean expression. So this is another question. Uh, so we have the the POS max term values given and the don't care values so we'll map them first so 1 3 5 8 14 then the max term values 1 3 5 8 14 and then 0 and 9 they are the don't care values okay so now we'll form the groups so first these two cells will form a pair then these two cells will form another pair and uh, these four cells 8 9 and 0 1 will form a quad and this one will form a single cell group okay so all the zeros the zero marked cells have been covered that is the first priority okay the only priority to cover all the zero marked cells okay we are not concerned about the x mark cells now we have to identify the common variables okay for this single group uh, the single cell group the horizontal and vertical components are a bar or p bar 
or C bar or D then for this quad involving cells 8 9 0 1 we have the horizontal side B common and the vertical side C common okay so B or C for this pair here involving cells 1 5 in the horizontal side A common the vertical side we have C or D D bar A or C or D bar and then for this pair involving cells 1 and 3 in the horizontal side we have A or B common the vertical side we have D bar common so A or B or D bar this is the simplified boolean expression okay